Hi Espers! We have our Boodle event for Tuesday, Project Lockout. An Anis Revenge type of event, kaya naman refreshed lang to. Medyo matagal-tagal na akong hindi nakita nito, pero grabe ah. I see tokens everywhere. One thing I noticed as well is yung second milestone from 50 umangat ng lima pa. So, 55 na yan ngayon. Let's see, mukhang token farming event to. Event duration is from December 28 hanggang January 3. So, for our 5 draws, 400 siya. First lang yan. As well as the first 1 draw, 90 na lang siya from 99. So, let's go for our promotion. Ops, ops, ops. Huwag nyo kong kakalimutan mag-exclude ng dalawang items na ayaw ninyo. There can be duplicates pag magpupul nga pala kayo. Espers, for example, i-exclude. Lud ko tong mga to. Pwede kang makukuha ng dalawang beses out of the 5 draws nitong 50 times tapos limang ano ba to? Project emblem pero ganun siya. Pwedeng mag-repeat yung prizes ninyo. Let's see kung merong random epic skin from the prize list. But now let's select our final milestone reward. Nothing new syempre meron na tayo nung Project Z na Prestige Edition. Let's click on this one. Going back to our info tab, ang last milestone, ang last milestone are Project Silas Z or Irelia na Prestige Edition. So if ever wala pa kayo nyan, tingnan natin kung sulit ng event na to. Let's go for our first 5 draw, 400 RPN. Uhuy, umuulan, ulan nga <laughs> ng tokens. So we have now 175 tokens. Grabe yung pag-farm nito ah. Take note ah, nung RP cost, mamaya pull kayo ng pull, wala na kayong RP. So now, puro naman box ngayon. Tanggalin natin tong susi, and ito, boom. <laughs> Chess galore! Siguro ang magiging discard ko dito if marami-rami yung tokens dun na ako magpupul. Pero if hindi naman ganun yung mangyayari, magwa-wandro lang ako para mag-refresh yung board. Right now, let's click on this. And ayaw ko nito. Boom! 9 naman ngayon. We are going to average this nga pala, Espers, per hour pull. Kung ilang project emblems yung pwede nyo makuha. Try lang natin abutin yung second milestone. Let's go for this one. Ayaw ko ng susi. Ayun, 150 debonair tokens and hextech chest. Pindutin na natin. Natin to. Ayaw ako ng Hextech Key Fragment for our 6th pull. Sana last na as well. Boom! Ayaw niya. <laughs> Mukhang 7th pull ang kailangan ninyo para mapunta sa second milestone. So I am not seeing any outliers here. Espers mukhang ang mga rewards are tokens, random superior skin, hextech key fragment, hextech chest, and may naita tayong kanina, masterwork chest. Even yung debonair orb. So yung debonair orb most likely yung pinakamaganda na pwede nyo makuha sa board ninyo. Let's click on this one. Gustong gusto natin ng tokens since we are not playing that much and hindi rin tayo kumuha ng battle pass. So for our 7th draw, doon na natin nakuha yung second milestone. Just click on this one and don't forget to select your reward right here and gawin natin yung debonair orb for our first milestone and then random epic skin naman ang nasa pangalawa nakuha natin siya as a hextech item buti naman and let's look at our loot ngayon mukhang ito na nga ang hinahanap yung espers kung gusto nyo ng token farming event medyo marami rin pa akong kulang dito kaya naman susulitin ko na to and get all the icon borders and chromas from the shop Well, it looks like gagastos talaga ako sa event na to since ang missing number of tokens ko pa ay 1,000. I-update ko na lang sa my pinned comment down below kung magkano yung susunod kong gagastosin in order to get that amount of tokens. Pero right now, wala pa rin yata yung border ni Prestige brand and yung nawala natin border ni Prestige Caitlyn. Di ko lang kung saan napunta yan but Garena, do try and fix this. Already. In terms of icons yan, nakuha natin. And let's analyze yung history natin. So, ang total RP cost natin for this event is 3,100 RP. 8 times Hextech Chest, 4 times Debonair Orb, and 725 Debonair Tokens. Ang worth nun is 3,652. So, malayo-layo lang ng around 500 RP. I would be rating this event as a 4 out of 10. Try this event only Only if you are aiming to get most of the items in the debonair shop. Siyempre, ang currency doon ay debonair tokens. If there are less than 5 or 6 items on your board that are debonair tokens, try to re-roll it by excluding 2 items and then drawing 1 time. Sana swerte yan kayo doon sa susunod nung board. 
and get something like this. Hassle nga lang ng sobra. Don't forget as well na ayun nga, mag-cross out ng two items before drawing here. Medyo masakit-sakit yung nangyari sa atin doon, kaya naman I only recommend this for those na may habol sa debonair shop. If you are looking for hextech items or loots, this event is not for you. Kita nyo naman, 3,000 na kagad ang nalaga sa tinap up natin from the 100% top up bonus. But then, ang sabi ko nga, since collector ako, I would be trying to get the 1,000 tokens or around kalahati lang nun since this debonair shop is until January 17, 2022. Malay nyo, meron pang lumabas na event na mas marami makukuha tokens. So project lockout 4 out of 10. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. As usual, Espers, ayun nga, we have a giveaway sa my Facebook gaming page natin. Nakapin na yan doon, kaya naman do check that out. I will be basing the entries para sa contest natin or giveaway doon sa mga nag-share publicly and nakita ko rin na nag-comment or tag ng friend nila on the comment section. Ingat-ingat tayo sa paggasto since patapos na ang 2021, e-enter naman natin ang 2022 na mas marami pang budol. Stay safe, Espers, and good luck sa grind ninyo.